What's going on guys, Bob Roach from RoachTechnology.com here with a quick video just to confirm a problem in the Hackintosh community and that is with messages. Now up until about two weeks ago, give or take, messages was working fine, you'd log in, everything would sync, unicorns were flying over rainbows and everybody was happy. Now, eventually what started to happen was messages would just start crashing. It just would not work, and when you go ahead, and we'll do this in real time, go ahead and try to open it back up. Of course, it prompts you to log into your Apple ID, so let's go ahead and enter that. Now, it's going to look like it worked. It's going to say you could be reached at these, I guess, locations. Go ahead and we'll click finish, and everything looks fine, but it actually is not fine because it will actually error out in just a few seconds, saying that it could not sign in and there you go messages quit unexpectedly now this is not a problem with this messages file I've tried to do a re, uh, fresh installation I've tried to uh, go to other people's Hackintoshes it is not working and it's not my Apple ID because I've tried other Apple IDs it is in fact my computer now I, everyone believes that this is sort of a, a switch that Apple has flipped on the Hackintosh community somehow some way our system is giving off something that lets Apple know that it's not a legitimate Mac computer and it seems that they've kind of for lack of a better word blacklisted our computer now the weird thing is that you can still log into the App Store you can still log into iCloud and system preferences everything there is okay it is in fact just messages but at the moment we have no solution for this there is no fix because we don't know what Apple uses to verify this now it could be something as simple as maybe a serial number but maybe we're not doing it right uh, if you go to about this Mac and go ahead and click your version here you actually see that you have a serial number there people have tried to change the serial number and in the past this has worked for iCloud but uh, this just does not work with messages so maybe there's something there that we're missing or there's just something that maybe we have no control over so at the moment like I said there is no fix for this it's something that I'm gonna be watching very closely because if you're like me you don't realize how much you actually used it until it's gone and you realize how convenient it really is now iMessage for me still works on my iPad and my iPhone just not on my Hackintosh now I've yet to log into a real Mac and try this so I'll definitely have to do that in the next coming days or so but for now there is no solution I just want to make this quick video letting you guys know that this is in fact a problem that you're not alone and that I'm sure we have great minds working on it as I speak I do have a few things in mind that I'd like to try I'd like to look at some of the plist files that make up messages and maybe look for something there that authenticates some random thing but uh, like I said at the moment there's currently no solution for this we will keep our eyes on this and I hope this video helps you guys somewhat I hope I can bring you a solution if and hopefully when we find one like I said we have some great Great minds out there, so I'm sure we can think of something. I'm at CPU Kid on Twitter. Also, be sure to check out RoachTechnology.com, and I'll see you guys in my next video.